Lena, you got two goals back there at the end, and uh, do you think you could have snatched a third, maybe? Oh, you never know, Walter. Um, we, we really, if you look at it, we weren't in the game for all day, but, but uh, a lot of heart and a lot of endeavour, and we just kept going and going, and that's what really what our season's been based on, and, and we did really well in that regard today, but but there's a lot of disappointment too in, in the way we, we manned up and, and the way we let South play, but, but I'm very happy with the, with the, the way the boys toiled. Your keeper did well? Yeah, he did, and he's done well all season. And uh, the back line was a little bit scrappy today, so so he had a lot of work to do. But but uh, South missed a few, but, but Dave saved a few too, so he went really well. Yeah, I was happy with him. You got two easy goals. Showed you what can be done. Yeah, they weren't easy goals. We had to work really hard for them. I think South got a couple of easy goals. But, uh, but yeah, 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 you work and you work and you work and, and you get the spoil sometimes. So today it just wasn't there. So do you feel disappointed or uh, missing out on three points and on the performance? How do you feel about that? Um, um, the, the performance as a, as a group, how they kept fighting it was fantastic. The performance, uh, South controlled the game really, but, uh, but I, I was a little bit disappointed we didn't. You, you always expect to win. And uh, it would have been nice to get a point, but uh, but we didn't. So we get next week down. Then uh, I just wanted to know about the um, only having two subs on the bench. What was the reasoning behind that? Yeah. Uh, it, it, it's hard to say. It's, it's it's very tricky when we've got teams playing in other venues and stuff like that. And and uh, I, I was going to have my son Alex Shorty here today, but but he needs you know, to have a test on his wrist, and he just got back from uh, from Europe, so. So we only brought two, and, and but it wasn't too bad at the end of the day. If you can't get through a game with two subs, you can't do it really. Is the Japanese lad all right after the head clash? Yeah, no, he's fine. I think it was just a clash of head, two heads coming together. But I don't think he really got hurt. I just think he was um, a bit bruised there for a while. He's not used to being knocked around like that, mate. Well, he scored two goals yeah. after that. Yeah, so, so, <laughs> so, so I might give him a, a whack in the head next <laughs> next week before we go out there. But, yeah, but no, no, he's, he's, he's been really good for us this year. He's been fam fabulous. Uh, you're still right in the hunt for a top six with just a few games to go. How are you going to approach those last few games? Oh, just like normal, mate. We, we, we'd love to to get a couple more wins, but, but you just don't know in this league. It's so even. I mean, I hear Rangers and, and Devonport have drawn, so that puts a seven, probably. So we're all equal on 21 points. You just... See how it goes. It's, it's great to be competitive. It's great to be in it. We haven't had that for a couple of years, but on the same token, it'd be nice to have a little bit of breathing space too. Big announcement next week. You confident of staying in? Of course, I'm, I don't think much will change, Walter. But uh, but we've worked really, really tirelessly. We, we've we've done everything right. We're getting some results, and or even if we're not winning, we're working real hard on the pitch. And, uh, and the guys in the committee are doing an extremely good job as well. So I don't think. We're in too much trouble. Thanks a lot. No worries at all.